Hey kids, it's Miss Wallace with another art video. Uh, today we're going to be drawing Porky from Toy Story, one of my favorites. But before we get started, we have a special guest today. Let me introduce you to the one, the only, my daughter, Presley Wallace. Hi guys. Presley, do you like Porky? Of course, he's like the funniest fork ever. He is the funniest fork ever. Okay, well, everyone, get your paper, get your pencil. If you have any colors, you get those out, and we're going to go ahead and get started. You ready? Yes. Let's do it. We'll go in, and we're going to draw an oval shape. Remember, draw lightly, kiddos. What we're going to do is we're going to make the actual um, top of uh, Forky's head here where it's kind of a zigzag but there's one two three four kind of points that we're going to be drawing so keep the top for right now it's going to be guiding us and you're going to go and start maybe over here and you're going to kind of keep this curve that goes up and then you're going to go down so that's one two three and then I'm going to come back down four Okay, it doesn't have to be perfect. We're just trying to get that fork, spork kind of look there. So now what I'm going to do is go in and let's go in and erase the top. You got it. And you know what? Let's go ahead and erase down here too. We're going to erase where the part that we hold his body. So just kind of erase a little bit there. All right, good? Yep. That's great. Okay, so I tell you what, let's go ahead and go in and do his face, okay? Um, let's start with the eyes. Now, Forky's eyes are kind of funny because he's got one big eye and one small eye. Mm -hmm. So let's start with a, a circle about that size on that side. Wait, so the left side is the big one mm -hmm. and the right side is the small one. Yep, so we're going to make a smaller circle over here. Not too small but definitely smaller than the first one. And then this is actually going to be the black part of the eye. Um, and so we need a little reflection of light. So go in and draw a smaller circle inside each of the circles we just did. And then with your pencil, go in and color in the bigger one. Okay, so let's go ahead and draw a circle around each one of these bigger circles. Um, good deal. That looks great. Yeah. Okay, so his eyebrow is actually one. Okay, it's just one big eyebrow. Mm -hmm. Yep. Like so, a rainbow. Yeah, kind of. Not maybe not that arched, but it's. I'm gonna just start off with kind of a little curve line, right above. Make sure it goes over both eyes. Like that. Uh huh. And then we're going to curve up and a curve up. And then we'll connect it with another line. Okay, good job. All right, now we're going to work on his mouth. And his mouth is kind of interesting looking too. Yeah. Um, yeah, I think that's going to be better for us. Oh, yeah. Okay, now we're going to make a curve right here. It's kind of his lips. <laughs> and then I'm going to go over and then I'm going to curve down and then curve under and back up. I need to make mine a little bit skinnier. I think I need to make this a little bit longer. All right. All right. So I think we're kind of done with this head. Let's move on to the body. So for the body, this is the part that, you know, you would hold on to if you're actually using him. And because he's kind of cartoonish, we don't have to make it real long. We can actually make him kind of short. So I've got two lines going down. It's kind of curved a little bit even. Good job. Now, Forky has putty at the end of his body. I thought body. it was clay. Um, I think it's a putty, actually. Mm -hmm. It looks kind of malleable, so you can still move it around. So do a little wavy line here, but notice how I went past just a little bit from the body, the lines of the body. So I went over here and over here. All right, and then to make it look a little bit more 3D, we're going to start here and go around like that. And then the same thing on this side. 
There you go. The way it looks like it's actually stuck in there. And then we're going to do a, um, kind of a wavy one, but it's going to kind of drop down right here in the middle and then come back up. Good job. I think they're like little popsicle sticks. Yeah, I think they're popsicle sticks that have just broken in half. Uh-huh. And so what we're going to do is on the side here, I'm going to go down and then curve it and then back up. Kind of like clown feet. Kind of has a clown vibe to him, doesn't he? Yeah. And I'm going to do the same thing over here. I tried to make him a kind of the same length. It doesn't have to be perfect, but try your best. Now we're going to make the his popsicle feet look a little bit more 3D. So we're going to make another curved line that kind of comes down and goes back to the putty here. And then the same thing over here. And Forky actually has a little, I think it's a sticker, it's a rainbow. Yeah, it's a rainbow. It's a little rainbow. So if you look at it, a straight line, curve, straight line, and then... Awesome. Okay, now we're going to go in and we're going to work on his uh, his arms. And um, his arms, I believe, are made across across. Uh, it's like a pipe cleaner, right? Yeah, it's a pipe cleaner. Cool. So it actually looks like a letter X right here. But how we're going to do it is we're going to start with a diagonal line here and one right here. Notice these lines are parallel. Yeah. What? Using our math skills. And then on the end, you want to curve it here, connect it, curve it here, connect it. And then we're going to make the other X, but this one is going to disappear uh, behind this one. So like this? Yep, you got it, sister. So pretend, skip over, curve down. Like that. Oh, great job, babe. Okay, here we go. Now we're going to make the hands kind of come out, and they're super, super wavy. So from here, I'm just going to go down and up and down. Like, don't make it like a roller coaster, but almost like a little worm line. And then the one underneath it needs to go the same direction. Kind of does the same thing. And then Forky's got one, two, three fingers. And then we're going to do the same thing on the other side, but it's obviously going the other direction. So. Okay, let's add a little bit more detail to the body. So what we're going to do is we're going to add uh, a line that kind of comes out from his head here. It's going to come out just a little bit. I'm going to go down, skip over the whole X, and then go all the way down to the putty here. And then we'll do the same thing on the other side. Kind of keeps him from looking so flat. Just be sure to skip over that X. There you go. Looks great. And then we're going to make some little circle shapes. So there's one up here above the X, and then two below. We're going to space them out. Okay, so we're done with our actual uh, Forky, but I was going to show you guys how to go in and make kind of a Toy Story background. Mm, yeah. And so.
So kiddos, keep working. Um, but just know once you get done with this step, uh, Preston and I are going to go ahead and get our black Sharpie and we're going to start tracing all of our pencil lines. Um, you color in the black, or the, I should say the pencil here, the circles, we're going to color those in with our Sharpie. If you don't have a Sharpie, that's okay. You can use a black marker or a black crayon, whatever you have at your house. So we're going to do that next. All right, kiddos, we are done tracing with Sharpie. Presley did a great job. Thank you. Yeah. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go in and we're going to be using our crayons. Kiddos, you can use crayons. You can use colored pencils, markers, whatever you have at home. Um, but if you just want to watch Presley and I, we're going to start adding our color and you can follow along with us. Uh, remember, you can always pause the video if we're going too fast for you. All right, here we go. All right, Presley, did you have fun? Yep. Everyone, show us your Forky. This is ours. We love our Forky. They're so... There's like a baby one, and yours is like the real Forky. Yeah, one. a little bit. We hope you guys had fun, and I hope you guys are staying well. Take care. Bye. Bye.